Hey guys, today we're taking a look at DJ Mixer Pro for the Mac. This is available for OS X and Windows, so that's first off a nice little plus here. DJ Mixer Pro is a one of the world's most advanced virtual DJ software for your Mac and or Windows machine. It includes all advanced features that real DJs use, all via a digital interface. So you have like your two and four decks, and then you can do some prof uh, professional grading, mixing, playlists, all that good stuff. And I'm just going to take a look at it here. Again, this is it for the Mac here. Uh, you can get a free trial to test it out, and if you want the full version, you can go ahead and choose to buy it. Uh, get the full version. Again, this is a really great if you are into music and DJ mixing and all that. Um, I don't know, you know, a great deal about mixing and all that, but what's so great about this is that you can really kind of get a feel for it and really learn your way around, even if you're just kind of starting out. This is one of the top, uh, you know, digital, virtual, I should say virtual uh DJ mixing softwares out there. So here's the interface. You can see the interface does look, you know, maybe at first intimidating, but it is really kind of easily laid out. I really like how they label everything here. And even if you ho hover over everything, it gives you a description. And again, if, you, if you're more experienced in this, obviously you're gonna know what everything does. You're gonna know what everything means and stuff like that. But even for somebody like myself, who's not too experienced, they break it down into two simple things. On the very bottom here, you have your browser. You can import songs here. So for example, I import two songs from an album here. And I can just drag songs onto the uh, track like so. So I can take a song and then drag it here. I have four, looks like four virtual tracks here. And to play a song, just simple as a play button here. So I'm playing the song right here. And you can see it playing right there. And at the same time, I can play the other track here. So I can choose to play this if I want. And then this is playing right here. So you can hear that going. You can play both at once if you want. You can pause it, all that good stuff. Um, additionally, you can see here you have audio editors, so in the middle you can con uh, control your knobs for gain, uh, master, vol excuse me, master volume, all that good stuff. Um, you have a separate channel here for each of those. You can see here you have key locks, you have headphones, so you can monitor specifically just for this track or whatever it is you want to do because a big part of DJing obviously is going to be monitoring the songs yourself. You can send loops, time codes. Uh, really overall really clean interface and I, I say clean in that even though it's it's it has a lot of buttons as DJ software does you know if uh, since it is an advanced professional mixer it's going to include a lot of buttons you know it's it's not one of those things where you just kind of have one track and another track and you hit play and pause you can do tons of crazy things with this you can adjust sync you can adjust your BPM which is your beats per minute so you can kind of change the beats per minute um, you can set presets, you can set call loops or you know when the song is going to kind of loop. You can scrub through easily right here. You can see I can just pull through. You can also use the disc here and you can add virtual kind of scratching here. So I can add some scratching as you can hear there to the uh, song there. So you can hear that uh, virtual scratching there. Really, really nice. It has a video window here you can close out. In the top left you have options to go into preferences here. So you can see in the preferences you have things to adjust here. You can adjust stuff like fading, cross faders. Uh, pitch, tempo range, the default settings for these. You can adjust audio decks, again, for outputting and input. Um, you can select your default dis uh, audio device here, your controls here. You can also import if you have MIDI, MIDI devices, like a keyboard or anything. You can even select up to eight MIDI devices to hook up to this software. So that's really a huge plus. Again, really simple browser on the bottom left here. You can uh, go through your iTunes music, import your iTunes library, or simply just drag files in. Again, you have four virtual tracks here. You have your four virtual decks here to control them. And at the very top, you have other controls like minimize settings here. You can go to settings this way too. Um, adjusting uh, overall volume, fade out, fade in effects. You can record in tracks. So you can record in like audio or you can record anything to WAVE or AIFF files if you want to import those. Um, again, just really, really simple controls here. And it even shows you here, you have a CPU usage here and a time right here. So you kind of have everything you need all in this window. Really nice, really easy to use. This is DJ Mixer Professional for the Mac. Definitely worth checking out if you are into the mixing business or you're looking for a really great DJ software. Check it out today.